So what is the mission for today? We're going to finally save those villagers. That's the plan anyway, I'm going to try my best. Two episodes ago, we found out the villagers are still alive and they've been locked up this entire time. And in the last episode, we finally, finally found the abandoned mines. I've been looking all over the place for those mines. So we're actually going to go explore over there today. It is going to be awesome. Y'all are awesome. Thank you so much for being here for another episode of our Nine Souls adventure. I hope you're having an amazing day, an amazing night. Everybody say hi to Yi. How's it going, Yi? And the very first thing we're going to do is we have a gift for Sean Sean, who's chilling upstairs right now. So let's go give this gift to Sean Sean. This could possibly be the very last gift for Sean Sean. I honestly thought we had found all of them already, but we have an extra one. So the Fu Sang Amulet. I really hope there's still more to give. Here you go, Sean Sean. What are you holding in your hand, Yi? It's a Fusang amulet. It might have been left behind by miners who were illegally chipping away at the grottos. You can have it if you want it. It's usually worn around your neck. Uh, it's heavy and made of wood? People in the past used it for protection. It's just a silly superstition with no scientific basis. What's a superstition? It's blindly believing in something without any basis or proof. Take this amulet, for example. People thought by carving the mark of Fusang into it, it would be endowed with divine powers, allowing its wearer to... This amulet has magic powers? I'm gonna wear it every day. <laughs> I just told you, it's just a superstition, and that's just an ordinary piece of wood. If the mark had any effect, the scientists studying the primordial root would have already discovered it. Let's put it this way, if you're promised something good, but in exchange you must loyally follow orders and not doubt anything, chances are that's a superstition. So then... Our village ceremony was also a superstition? Now you get it. But without the ceremony, I wouldn't have been saved. I wouldn't be able to live here with you, Yi. And Shan Shan would probably be locked up with all the other villagers right now that need our saving. I guess something good did come out of it. Another one of your silly fallacies. We're always trying to find the positive outlook. Come on now. But if that's what you really think, why would you bring it all the way here for me? I picked it up. Might as well use it. Or do you want to give it back? No, I was just joking. I'm keeping it. Come on, man. It's kind of crazy because it's this moment of, is that the final gift, right? And we want to make sure Sean Sean is okay always because I don't know if he is making it out of this, everyone. I really don't. It's a it's a tough one, dude. But yeah, I really hope that Sean Sean and Yi are going to be making out of this because Sean Sean or Yi is trying to give Sean Sean all these like life, all this life advice, right? And Shan Shan is also very brilliant. Okay, was there anything else for us to do here? Did we have, uh, I think we have an extra chip, don't we? We have the abandoned mines chip. Let's go, hand it over. <laughs> Yo, my goodness. Did anybody find this? If you played Nine Souls, am I the last person in the history of the universe to find this place? Let me know. I know you can kind of go about these in different orders and stuff, but man, I found this place late. Hmm, I do remember picking up a broken assistive robot before takeoff. Ah, okay, so it was already broken. Hey, you, so high. Shanghai 9000, not broken. Shanghai 9000, good as new, only one goal since rolling out of the factory. Before goal is complete, Shanghai 9000 
won't go. Last map data. No. This is the last map data for you. No way. We found all of them? Let's go out real quick. There we we found the secrets. Oh, this is it is amazing, everyone. We found the secrets there. We found there's a boss. Oh, we have a boss in the abandoned mines. We are, we're missing two here. Overall, really solid, everyone. We did get the boss here though. Okay, so we're gonna be going right over here. It's gonna be awesome. Look at that. We're gonna be exploring to the right. And eventually that leads into this area, the galactic dock. And that's where. Everyone's locked up right now. So we want to teleport right here to the factory. No, actually no. It's better to teleport up here. We're level 23 right now. Where the heck is our percentage for this for this game? Oh, 77%. <laughs> wow, everyone, 77. Oh, this is crazy. Can we get a new skill? Uh, enhanced water flow. Okay, we need to get this right here. We just got the chi boost, increased maximum, yeah, chi charge capacity. I love it. And then the next thing we need is enhanced water flow, which requires three points. We've got new jades as well, but I'm pretty happy with the build we have right now. And we are teleporting right back. I was using this teleportation so much in the last episode. We've been jumping over here, jumping over there. Speaking of which, we also have the treasure hunt to do. There are so many things, everybody. I still need to figure out, too. I need to figure out, like, the bells. There's definitely more to those bells. I remember seeing that in, like, episode one of the early episodes and then one of the later episodes as well. There's got to be more to that. Okay. Let's just drop right down. So for this area, we're actually missing two treasures. Because, yeah, it looks like we're missing a little bit. If you go... It's actually not that way. <laughs> if you go more to the left, though. Oh, dang. There's no air dash? There it is. It was just on cooldown. I am rusty, everybody. My goodness. I haven't played this in, like, a week again. Oh, hello there. And it's been brutal, guys. I've been, um... I've been editing um, these videos down, and I've been listening to what y'all are saying, and my gosh, it turns out you can parry way easier in the air, and if you're on the ground, you need to parry in the direction you're, like, the enemy's attacking from. I was just going to see what was going on right there. There's something, like, right around here. Look at that. Yeah, there's a giant chest, which we do need. But we don't have a way to get there. So. Probably need to get there from that side. Okay, we'll have to make a mental note of that. Because I do want to find absolutely everything in this game, if I can. Like, massive shout out to everyone who's been watching, who's been supporting this series. It's cool to see. Like, I've been seeing a lot of comments saying like yo go explore there's so much more to see right so that's awesome it's been awesome uh meeting so many cool people through this game pop we deal so much damage now i love it okay we have 450 money this is it this is it right here the abandoned mines. Oh. Yeah. This is as far as we've gone, everybody, right here. From this moment on, it's going to be something new. And I really hope we're not getting our hopes up. Please let us save the villagers. They need us. We got this, ye. It's so dark. This sounds like a heartbeat. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, good. This is so uh, exciting to have a new place that we haven't explored yet. Shh, shh. 
Ah, <laughs> oh, they got us. Can't believe it's only like two hits to kill him now. This is so cool. But is there more? Oh, there's more over here. Now, is there more down there though? Oh, let's be careful here. Let's summon our friend and just kind of investigate. Okay, we don't have much else here. Okay, so this just lights up the way. Not bad. Just want to make sure. Yeah, it's all looking pretty good here. Okay, I'll make sure we don't miss any treasure. This abandoned mine, everybody. It's so quiet. Wait a second. What the heck was that? I'm seeing an upstairs area. Anything we could do with this? Maybe we'll go here later. Look. <laughs> Heard some of that growling. Maybe that's where we'll go later. So the first one they showed us was there to like introduce the mechanic, right? Oh, beautiful. Oh my goodness. Dude, can you just give up? <laughs> as soon as he died though, we have so much healing now. Just chilling on those spikes. Gotta light up the way, it's so dark. Okay, nice. What the heck was this right here? Oh, there's one of those things. You just gotta hack it. Nice. Now we just have lights. Love to see it. Let's go. Is this going to be the final node in the entire game? Pretty much. Ah, uh, we've got to go around. So we gotta start over here. Let's get this guy. Ooh, good hits. Again. I was actually surprised I got it last time, to be honest. There it is. You really just need to wait for the visual indicator. It's like a little, little spark. Dang, where do you go? Dang, what do we think, a sniper or what? Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, this was so fun. Just gonna look over here in case there's anything better than that way. Just can kinda get a sneak peek by using our friend here, which is so cool. But we need to find where we can activate the lights. Okay, I'm just going to say we need to lock it in and fight this dude. What was the way up? Here it is. Just need to be smart. Oh, good hit, good hit. Man. Oh, I'm dead, guys. Okay. We're getting warmed up. We're getting warmed up. Oh, no joke. Just started playing uh, Sekiro as well. I'm streaming that one over on Twitch. And I feel like this game has been good practice to get me ready <laughs> for that because that game is so tough. Let's try this again. I don't want to lose any money, even though I only have like a couple hundred. But we need all the money we can get because we need to buy jades. I'm just unloading, man. Oh 
Oh my gosh, bro. Get out of there. Did we just run by him, bro? I just want to turn on the lights. <laughs> oh gosh. Yo, let's get let's get this right here. It's literally just this. Turn on the lights and now let's fight. Okay, now we're officially ready. He actually regens health too, so I, I respect that. Good hits, man. We got this, we got this. I'm seeing the combo. Nicely done. You got him. Let's go! You see, we just had to turn on the light. That's it. Crush that, that was awesome. <laughs> we got another catalyst, love to see it. That was dedicated to all the legends. Thank you all so much. Uh, cool, man. So this will increase our healing effect. That was a rush. Nothing else over here, right? Good job, ye. And we get more arrows. Plus, we get to refill our all our health right here. There is a higher up area right over here. Uh, we're missing two treasures. Okay, so... Oh, yeah, yeah, we just gotta go up. Okay, thank goodness. Dang, I don't know who's there. <laughs> I can't believe we kill them in such little hits now, too. Okay. Gosh, okay. This is crazy, dude. They better not shut off the lights. Is this anything important? Hmm. Is this where you use the thing? Let's go! Abandoned Mines Access Token. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Heck yes, let's do it. Wow. That is incredible, but no, we're not done here yet because I know you're hiding something else. I know you're hiding something else around here. Hmm, yeah, we got a little something. If you go down, where the heck is something to turn on the light? There's a whole other thing over here, guys. Okay, well, let's start by going down. Yeah, this is to open up the shortcut. So that's good. Hmm, two, oh, we have a couple chests over there. Anything else? I can't believe there's this much. Let me drop this down here just to see if it's worth <laughs> if it's worth going all the way over here. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, that is definitely worth it. Dude, this water looks awesome. That water looks really cool. Okay, yeah. Well, we could you know, we could hack that already, but we'll do that after victory. We need to fight them, but we have to fight them in the dark? Okay, I say let's just do it. We have the shortcut now, so... Oof. Yeah, we actually deal a ton of damage to this guy. 
Oh man, I really need to do my uh Nice hit, nice hit. Very nice hit there. Are you gonna do the heavy attack? No heavy attack. Oh, I just missed it, dude. I just missed it. I need I need redemption, guys. I need redemption. Let me try again to do that heavy attack again. Come on, buddy. There it is. We did it. Awesome! Have to. Have to at least try. You gotta try, you know? It makes it just so satisfying. That is like one of my favorite things about this game is that unbound counter. And here we have another Dust Guardian, perhaps? Ah, uh, okay. I thought it was gonna be like a log too. You could read about what happened to them. All this water here. So we just increased our strength. Can we go swimming? Oh, I can't believe that water is going to hurt us. Are you kidding me? It looks so nice. Whoa. <laughs> Yo, Guru. Wait a second. No, 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 no. It's not the Guru. Is that where we started the game? Yi was sitting right here, I'm pretty sure. Gosh, that was like a month ago. How the heck do I get there? Maybe we can find a way up here. Wait one second, wait one second. Where is this? Hmm, no way. Is, is this where we dropped in the very beginning of the game? This is crazy, dude. Because that means like the village and stuff was right there. <laughs> That's the livestock area. I always imagined it was way above, you know, ground, but let me zoom out of this. This is a giant ship. That's really cool, man. Okay. Well, I really hope we can still go back over there. Actually, let me just double check our details here. We are missing one treasure. I don't know what the treasure could be. Ah, maybe this. <laughs> is that officially it? We have 1100. That is not the treasure that we are looking for. You know what? It was, uh, uh, there's something more to the left. Okay. Let's keep going this way. We gotta, we gotta get it all. Oh. Beautiful work. Jeez, I don't know. <laughs> I was button mashing. Swift Blade Jade. Increases triple slash attack speed. That's amazing. Oh, but inflict. Wow, and some internal damage to ye. You know what? This is all high risk, high reward. So, I really like that though. Oh, I'm just so pumped to even replay this game, everyone. I hope this is one of those games that once you beat it, there is a higher difficulty unlocked. Because that would be really awesome. So much fun. And with that, we have found absolutely everything here. So now, let's, uh, let's just go ahead and replenish all our health. We have all our health back, and what do you think? How do we look? Do we look presentable? Let's go meet up with all the villagers. Oh, we got to get over there without taking any damage. <laughs> Was it over here or is it higher up? Dude, this is crazy. It's going to be a little bit higher up. And now, there we go. We're officially ready. They're going to be like, what the heck took you so long? I always say the sloth is my spirit animal. So they shouldn't be too surprised. I'm just going to be happy if we didn't get locked out of this. And we got some new lore. 
Yeah, I'm just trying to look at this and see if it does look like the starting cave. Cave stone inscription, a message someone left behind. To all those seeking answers, do not go any further. Obey the gods and be an ignorant peach blossom villager. Live well. The message engraved on the stone must have been left by some unknown ape man. To all those seeking answers, don't go any further. It's just, you just live your life, you know? Instead of seeing like what life actually is, just keep on going, keep believing. And that's better than what's actually like some of the horrors that are going on. I wanna know about this guru. I wanna know like, where are they? Cause they just left? I love this music right now. This is so awesome, everyone. Oh, gosh. Has so much money. I'm just so excited to see what's coming up. It's, uh, it's a joy. <laughs> Wait a second. This might be around the starting area. Oh my gosh, I remember this. I want to say I remember this from the very beginning. Wow. And we talked to Shan Shan down there. And it's so, like, man, these characters have grown on me so much. Back then I was like, oh yeah, you know, Shan Shan's cool, Yi's cool. I'm, like, actually getting chills right now. Just taking it in. Appreciating the visuals, appreciating the music. We got this right here where that might have been where Yi was. And then, yeah, I remember this in the beginning, like, hit this. This is where we lived. I want to go... Yeah, I remember this skeleton here. Oh, this was one of the first... Gosh, if we could find that. That was one of the first things we found. That was one of the first things we found in terms of, like, lore. Oh, I like it. I like that they actually show you an image of where you found everything as well. Is it actually going to go in order? This was it. Dead person's note. Crooked words etched into the ground. I found the exit. But there's no way to go back now. <sighs> this messy note seems like the last words of the deceased before they passed away. There's no way. I found the exit. Where can you go? They're in some kind of like... I'm still trying to decide. I'm pretty sure this is a ship. Like they're in a giant ship right now. That's my crazy theory, that this is a ship that's going through water. I think it's there's actual water on the outside because we saw those sea creatures. I don't think that was just a hologram. So one, we're either on a ship and there's a bunch of water all over the place. So there's nowhere for this place, this person to go because where are they going to run off to? Into the water and just die out there? Or two, we're actually going through space and then the fish were a hologram. I mean, maybe that's the guru. Maybe that's the guru there, right? I'm just going over here for old time's sake. And then this is where we started. We've grown so much since then, not just with like health and like how many times we can heal and our chi charges, but also just all the life lessons and stuff from Yi and Shan Shan. They came out here and they said, hey, the ceremony is going to be later today. Incredible. I'm actually happy that we found this as late as we did. Because it's a nice... I don't know, it's like a nice thing to like look back on this late into our journey. Because we have been through so much. And this is it, we're going into the village. Oh, dude, I'm so pumped. <laughs> This is so cool, guys. 
We're going into the village and it's going to be completely empty now. Wow. It's all glitching out. <laughs> New music. Nice. Let's go, man. This is incredible. Ooh, we're good. We gotta do this for the villagers. Let's go! Dude, Yee's out here just kicking butt and taking names, man. <laughs> this is so awesome. Oh. Remember seeing this right here? Yeah, all the ten souls. The statues. Oh man, do the statues mean more now? Something different. I think this might be for the villagers, no? This music is incredible and like... I definitely didn't think it was like a simulation almost, you know? With the background glitching out right now. And then even hearing Shan Shan talk about how small the world was back then. Like, what do you mean it's super small? But it's not a planet, that's why. I thought back then it was they were actually on a planet. They had the whole festival, the very last one. <sighs> Let's just look at this. Um, so we, we did find... Oh, there's one thing we're missing. Hold on. Somehow there is one collectible we're missing. How the heck are we missing a collectible here? Man, I'm almost tempted to go back over there and find the thing. It's okay, we'll wait. Let's go save these villagers and we can always return later. It's just too awesome. Dang, this is gonna be a tough one. You're dead. Dude, no, we're not rushing through this. Look at the destruction here. This is where the festival happened, where the sacrifice happened. That sacrifice happened and it was so, I mean, it was amazing of like not showing everything because it was a silhouette, but it was so effective and impactful. Awesome storytellers. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, we never went this way. Wow, what's up? Dude, you're so lucky. You're so lucky this guy's here. No, I'm way too slow on that one. I've got... There we go. Ooh, he actually did a little combo. Mistimed it. Mistimed it. I'm, like, still running in that... It's crazy. Oh my gosh. He's so close. I mistimed it. Dude. Wow, at the last second. Are you kidding me? We got him. We got him. Let's go. Good job. Little ugly. We have so much health now. That's got to lead to where they are. Dark steel, nice. Yeah, we can upgrade our arrows and stuff. Heck yeah. So if you drop down right here, this took me so long to realize, but yeah. And we were saying it earlier in this episode, but like this was the starting area. I can't believe that. Even looking back, like, oh, I, where, where did we start from? I always thought it was up. 
always thought it was higher up because it was like, you know, towards the ground. And this was an underground facility is what I thought originally. So, yeah, I was super wrong. But no, we definitely want to go over here. We have everything there. We're just, yeah, we're missing. We're missing something right here. One little thing. We'll get that after we save the villagers. Come on now. We've got a job to do. This is why we're here. There they are. Yo, I am so sorry it took me so long. Hey, everybody. Hopefully we can, uh, we do have, like, the key to get them out, right? Hey, everyone. You're free. We did it. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> wow this is awesome we got the shaman here dude is everyone just gonna i'm gonna say the same thing i told everyone else go to the pavilion all right everybody go to the pavilion if they actually go to the pavilion though that would be so amazing alas you are a, a, a god a god has manifested you are our savior and for that we are humbly and eternally grateful God is merciful, and he brings bountiless blessings. All right, let's get organized once you're done worshiping. There might be a few more enemies around. The Peach Blossom Village is honored to have your divine protection. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Shen? Dude, you found another way in? He looks so serious. <laughs> Don't be stupid. He's not a god. You're an embarrassment. How are you still so stubborn after what we just witnessed? Yeah, because of all of this, it's like, forget about the souls. Yeah, for a moment I thought he was yelling at us. No, he's yelling at, he's yelling at the shaman. Anang? You're safe? Huh? You silly boy. Where did you run off to? Do you know how worried we've all been? <laughs> He's been with me. He was the one who asked for help this time. He asked us for help, huh? That's true, we did save him way back over there. That was so fun running into him randomly. Not you. Nonsense. That's, that's not what happened. Is that so? Thank you for taking Anang under your care. Uh, I mean, our most sincere gratitude for your kindness. Mm. <clears throat> Make no mistake, he's only here because of that brat Shan Shan. You're all just lucky to have survived. With the village destroyed, you'll be facing many more dangers. You better be prepared. Huh? Don't exaggerate. Our village has suffered a temporary setback. That is all. Fear not, everyone. If we pray with sincerity, we will quickly be able to return to our original lives. The village is now crawling with metallic beasts. Only an idiot would return. Zip it. The divine one still watches and it's disrespectful to yell. I've had it. Nothing I say ever gets through to any of you. You can all go fend for yourselves. I don't care anymore. In fact, I want to see how long he decides to keep you alive. I want to see how long he decides to keep you alive. What do you mean he? As in me, ye? <laughs> Yo, Shenong, I better have gained your trust, bro. What are you talking about? Aw, oh, man, I wish ye would have said something. <gasps> Divine One, please forgive Anang's irreverence. He's right. If you want to live, you shouldn't return to the village. Set up shelter here until this blows over. This area is connected to the docks, so it should be relatively safe. <sighs> if that is your divine will, then we shall obey. May we continue to receive your blessings 
and emerge safely from this disaster. Survival is your number one priority right now. Merloy. Understood, Divine One. Uh -huh. <clears throat> right, I just wanted to ask about Anang. The boy hasn't been causing you trouble, has he? He hasn't done anything that would hinder me, but he can be a bit noisy. Ah, <laughs> uh, we're so sorry. The kid has always been blunt to a fault. Your tolerance is appreciated. Hmm. Since you'll be seeing him again, can I ask you to pass something on? What is it? I have some poison here. No, please don't misunderstand. I'm not trying to hurt him. His body is... We know, right? It's fine. I know this might as well be medicine to him. Ah, so you already know of his condition. Wonderful. It can be difficult living alone with his condition. He's so fortunate to have someone taking care of him. I never said I was taking care of him. Oh yes, if he asks where you got it, just tell him you picked it up off the ground. <clears throat> well then, <clears throat> On behalf of the entire Peach Blossom Village, I would like to send our best wishes to you, O oh Divine One. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, right? <laughs> Nobody really looks super happy to see us. Yeah, we got the the porcine gem, the gallstones of the Dangkang Boar. It can be used as medicine, but ingesting it without going through the proper filtering process can lead to heavy metal poisoning. Need to find a way to rebuild. Hmm. Where can we find water here? Oh, we gotta get them water and food. So I'll make sure, hey, if anybody needs anything, like seriously, there is enough room in the pavilion. I'd be super happy. This is where they were the entire time. We did it though, everyone. We saved the villagers. Yes, <laughs> we did it. Oh, that feels so good. That feels so good, guys. And here we have this. So the dock is here. I'm still trying to figure out how you open this because there's definitely more to that than meets the eye. Well, um, let's go ahead and rest up really fast. But before we head back to that spot, yeah, before we head back to that, let's run. Oh, yo, y'all have set up quickly here. <laughs> Look, they got a bunch of stuff. Can I talk with anyone? Hey, everybody. He said something like, we don't want to starve. How do I give you food? Um, I'm just gonna run back over and see if we can find the one treasure because we have almost 100% completion And actually let's go ahead and look 78% complete everyone and the music is different now It's not the same now. It's like all Relaxed Like who is this statue of is that is that supposed to be Lear? It's not supposed to be us. I don't think Maybe it is supposed to be us, because we never found our statue for the souls. I'm not sure. Okay, this next area might be. It is. This is the area where we're missing one thing. And I imagine it's something we couldn't have accessed before.
Okay, I'm just going to maybe trust the game and think like we got to come back here later. But let's go back to Shen and uh, give them this. Is anything going to be different in here with the village? Our food stocks are nearly empty, guys. How do I give you Hi. food? I can't let the villagers starve. How do I give you food? Maybe if we go back, we can talk with... Maybe Shan Shan will be the one be like, Hey, let's bring them here. Let's go to the pavilion. Hello, hello, hello. Yo, Shen. Where is everyone? So quiet. Yo, what's up, Shen? I got something for you. On you. Ah, darn it. Gotta drink this. Avenge my shame. I refuse to believe that I can't beat that tiny worm. Slow down. You're drinking too much. What worm did you encounter? Huh. Huh. The village is in trouble again. You just stay put. They want to believe in their magic and gods? Let them. Taste the pain. Not like anyone out there will help me. What happened? Oh, I'll need to make another trip to the Peach Blossom Village? <laughs> is this... Is this seriously the final collectible? Oh gosh, I just spent like 15 minutes trying to look all over the place. It, was, it wasn't 15, it was probably like 10. We need to go back over there. Okay, this is good news. I need that closure. Hopefully that's the last little thing we need for 100% in that area. We need to go back over there. Hold on. Okay, well let me give this to you. This is the poor sign gem, my friend. We might even increase our overall health. The worm. I mean, he's mentioned a snake before, I'm pretty sure, hasn't he? This just tastes like candy. Are you trying to trick me? No. Those were the gallstones of a Dang Kang boar, which have a really high heavy metal content. Mm. Mm. It's breaking apart in my mouth now. Bitter on the outside, but surprisingly sweet on the inside. Huh? What? You crushed it with your teeth? It's practically made of metal. <laughs> Chill. What? I always crush hard candies between my teeth. And I think we might, yeah. Let's go. It's been a minute since we've had one of these. One of these moments. Cheers, my friend. Uh, I have a question. If we were kidnapped by you monsters... Where did we originally come from? The pale blue planet. Huh? My hometown is blue? It was, at least when we discovered it. Your home is just like Panglai. Oceans and life as far as the eye can see. But, due to the presence of New Kunlun, it's probably just a land of ice and snow now. Wow. Dang, okay. <laughs> what the heck did you all do to our planet? You all destroy Earth? Jeez. Like, does Nukon Lun, I mean, Nukon Lun is just changing everything, man. So, yeah, what did they do? I mean, this is a huge question mark that I've had with, like, what the heck has been going on. What happened to Earth, right? Where did they come from? So yeah, it's just a planet of ice and snow. Brutal. Oh, don't give me just that. So your sorcery can change entire worlds? Unbelievable. It's all my fault. Bro, you destroy a whole just species pretty much? Not even just humans, like humans, not just humanity. Max increase, bro. They destroyed a whole planet. I mean, we're talking, <laughs> we're talking all life on a planet. My gosh. Dang, man. Ah, oh, yee, bro. What the heck? No wonder it's it's so much, man. So much. Hmm. Sean, Sean, what are you doing up there? You just chilling? Let's actually try to buy some jades or see if anybody wants to talk. 
Like, Sean Sean doesn't have anything to say. Okay, they do. <laughs> what to say about the villagers? I heard the news from Anang. Thank you. If it weren't for you, who knows what would have happened to the village? Hmm. Relax. The people in the village might not be the brightest, but they aren't as weak as you think. Also, Shenang might say he doesn't care, but given his disposition, he would have acted even if I hadn't. He'll come out and save everyone, right? Yo, let's go. Ah, uh, Anang is just like you, saying one thing while meaning another. <laughs> Don't be silly. He isn't just like me. Let's leave it there. I have urgent matters to attend to. <laughs> that was amazing. Oh, it's awesome, dude. I love this game. Every day I get to sit down and experience this game for the first time. Press that record button is a treat, everyone. Thank you so much for being on this journey with me. Nothing else? Are you kidding me, bro? We only have one more of this, oh, this fruit, which is really expensive. Let's just buy the jades, everyone. Even though we'll also upgrade our health, but... Just to get closer to collecting all of the jades. And I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to, I'm sorry. I'm taking all this money with me. <laughs> sorry. Except for that coin. I mean, I don't know if I can bring myself to break down that coin. Okay, let's buy the recovery jade. Boom. You only have three more things for sale, my friend. 2k for that one. So we've got one jade there. And then we have two jades right here. So, for 758. Oh, we're getting pretty close. Let's go talk to Kuafu first. What's up, Kuafu? You don't have anything to say about the villagers. Dang, bro, you got nothing to say? All right, let's modify 800. I figured it was 800. Okay. Well, we'll just get that uh, next time here. So we need to return over there. I'm just, I'm doing a quick scan just to make sure we have collected all of the... Shanghai 9000 chips, and it looks like we have. They did say we did, but I just wanted to double check. Well, does it, do they have anything to say? Nothing. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. We're going to pause this episode, everyone, right here as difficult as it is to do that that's all my recording time for this episode but we'll pick up in the next one and we'll go right to the village and take care of this worm or whatever shen was saying this was so much fun i had an amazing time i'm so happy that we got to explore a new area today we got to finally save the villagers and it was a blast from the past we got to see Peach Blossom Village, and it was under a completely new light. Amazing music, really fun combat, and it was just awesome. Awesome storytelling with everything glitching out, and yeah, absolutely love that. And we gave a gift to Sean Sean. I would say that was a really awesome day. I hope you all had some fun. Thank you, as always, for watching. If you had a good time, press the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. All the support means the world a massive shout out to our channel members and patrons y'all are absolutely awesome and thank you all so much for watching stay safe stay awesome and i hope to see you soon later later